Looking to punch it into the end zone for the first time. Scenes like this, from the action on the field to the cheering in the stands, won't be happening this fall at Purdue University. With the Big Ten canceling fall football, a big part of the college experience is disappearing for students, players, and coaches. We were looking forward to it, and uh, we were excited about playing a conference-only schedule of 10 great uh, teams in our conference. In a statement, the Big Ten said in part, it became abundantly clear that there was too much uncertainty regarding potential medical risks to allow our student athletes to compete this fall. The news came as a shock here to many students at Purdue. They say they had hoped to fill the seats inside of this stadium this fall. Instead, they have to only hope that sports will return this spring. I was kind of expecting it to happen because I knew a few other schools had canceled their season, but I was pretty upset because I've been to like the Purdue football games before and they're really fun. I was a new person here, barely knew anyone, and the few friends I made, we just we made plans to go watch the football game. and. That was one of the best experiences I had in my life. Brahm says a lot of discussion needs to happen to ensure players can return safely in the spring. I'm hopeful that uh, our entire conference and when it's all said and done, everyone involved can find a way to play football in the spring, especially if we really want to play football and give our seniors a chance to play football. Here in Bloomington, the parking lot of Memorial Stadium is serving as a COVID-19 testing site for new students arriving on campus for the fall semester. Memorial Stadium will not host football games this fall. IU Athletic Director Scott Dolson says he was heartbroken by the postponement of the fall sports season, but he also said he was confident it was the right decision. Teams still practice Tuesday, even as the announcement was expected. But now the season postponed for men's and women's cross country, men's and women's soccer, field hockey, volleyball, and football. But let's talk about the other big college conferences tonight. The ACC and SEC say their plans for fall remain unchanged. And we've seen reports online tonight that the Big 12 is planning to move forward with preparations for its football season. So far, no confirmation from the conference itself. But if one of those conferences decides to postpone, that could cause a domino effect for all the others.